Hey guys! So today I'm going to be doing a little bit of a nail demo for you. I'm just going to be showing you how to recreate this look. I don't know if you can see that very well, but you'll see a close-up in a minute. Um, it's using the OPI Black Shatter nail varnish that they brought out um, earlier this year. And it's really, really simple to do. Absolutely anybody can do it. So um, I'll show you the products that you need to use and then we'll get going. Okay, so this is the look that we're going to go for. Um, it's all the products that are being used are from OPI. Um, they're really, really good products. The, the varnishes do tend to last a lot longer and I have tried so many um, different products whilst working with my beauty clients that actually this is the best one that I've found so far. Um, so obviously I've done this hand, so I have kept a couple of nails free to do. And what we're going to do first is pop on a base coat, always important, um, it protects the nail from staining with the nail varnish but also gives the lacquer that you're going to put on something to stick to. I always use this one which is the OPI Nail Envy, um, really really good for strengthening the nails but also gives a nice shine so if you just wanted to just pop a, a quick shiny coat on you could use this one on its own. Um, so just pop on a real thin coat of this. and that will just literally take seconds to dry. Uh, the second coat that I'm going to use is um, this one. I've chosen a nice gold OPI polish here which is actually called Glitzerland. I hope you can see that there. Um, this one is uh, the colour that I've chosen today but you could choose any colour you wanted to go underneath the black shatter. Um, what I would suggest doing is just popping on a couple of thin coats um, otherwise it all builds up because you then have two coats of colour and one coat of the black shatter. Try and be a bit more careful than I was there. So just pop on your coat of paint. Again any colour you like. Um, I've done this look with a real bright pink and an orange as well, looks really nice. Um, but basically what happens is when you put the black on then as it breaks up the colour that you've put on underneath will pop through. So you can literally choose any colour you like. Just for the purpose of this demo I'm really going to do one coat of that one today. And then comes my favourite bit, this is the black shatter bottle. You'll notice it's slightly different with the um, lid has got the silver shattering on. Um, this one is available all over the place so you could just find out where that one's from. Um, I can't remember the price to be honest but it is a fantastic product um, so it's something that you know anyone can use. Now the key to working with this is you do have to work quite quickly, it dries very quickly. Um, so you want to make sure you've got enough on your brush, um, not too thick um, and literally wipe it on as you would the other varnishes. Don't worry if you get it on your fingers because you can just go around and take it off. And as you can see, it dries pretty much instantly and gives you that shattered look. When you get the shatter onto the nails, it's never going to be particularly uniform, so none of your nails are going to be exactly, you know, perfect. So the the thicker the varnish, the more lumps you'll end up with like that, and the thinner, the more it breaks up. So just go with how you feel like doing it really. And then I'll do this one. There you go. And again, I've got a little lump there, like a thicker line, so that one's going to break up a bit slower there. So I don't know if you can see those. And you get the nice sort of shimmery colour coming through there, so they're really, really good. So just give that a few seconds to dry, and then you're going to pop on your top coat, again, just to seal that colour in, but also to stop it from chipping, and hopefully it will last you a good few days to a week. Um, the one I'm using again is a really, I've got a mini one here, of an OPI Rapid Dry Top Coat. Um, again, their top coats and base coats are really, really good um, quality, so these are the ones I use. So... You could leave it a little bit longer, but for today I'm just going to go straight on and pop that on. And then once you've done this, you can just go round the edges and tidy up 
any little bits you may have got on the skin. So don't panic about those because you can just use a, a Q-tip and some nail varnish remover just to get rid of those. So I'll just do those quickly and then our look is complete. So there you are. So that is a gold and black shatter nail varnish. Well, I hope you've enjoyed the demo today and you feel there's something you can do yourself at home. Um, it is so easy, so um, give it a go. It's really good. Um, if you have any questions on the products that I've used or any of the techniques or want any tips at all, just send me a message. Um, there's also a little bit of um, a blog about this one um, that I've written, so uh, if you want to have a look, the web address is further down the page. But um, I shall see you all soon. Take care.